The notion of celebrity is changing. Um, you know, if you were to ask a group of young people to list their 20 favorite celebrities, at least 10 of them probably would people, be people we haven't ever even heard of. Uh, because of the advent of the YouTube star and of you know things like makers or big screen and a full screen rather and so uh, I think that the notion of the accessible celebrity has become very uh, relevant to a, a generation um, whereas we you know the, the traditional celebrity maybe has a connection going way back to the days of, you know, the grand movie star. And I think that's really shifting and that there's a, a desire people have for their own participation. I think it's another reason why, you know, television has become in its own way a communal experience because you can tweet while you're watching, which you don't do in a movie. Uh, you can be connecting with your friends, followers, etc. Uh, kind of while you're taking in a story and have your own things to say about it. And so that porousness, I think, has, is a change agent. And exactly how it shifts the game, I'm not sure. I think it has contributed to the uh, sense that the brand becomes more important than the movie star. So you can change Spider-Man, who plays Spider-Man, because people are going to go see Spider-Man more than they're going to go see the actor who is playing Spider-Man. Um, and it's still about great casting. Someone like Jen Lawrence, I don't think, I can't imagine Hunger Games, even with its very popular books, being nearly the success that it's been without Jen Lawrence being the perfect person to play that role and a very modern celebrity, a very down-to-earth, accessible celebrity. Um, but I think that uh, it's, it's, it's a very changing area. Um, and I think increasingly studios realize, yeah, that the brand certainly means more than the movie star. And there are fewer and fewer movie stars who reliably mean anything on the one hand, and yet they still provide a degree of comfort for international sales that's a little bit at odds with itself, I think, right now. Um, and I think, I think it's, it's an area that's in flux.